The university spent $13,000 on a search that ended with hiring the interim provost. Mm -hmm. Why spend so much if you are already confident about Butler as provost? You know, I find that question offensive. I'll be real honest I'm with sorry. you. Okay? Um, national searches, I don't know any other national search that only costs $13,000. Now, to make, to make anyone a legitimate candidate for a position as important as provost, you've got to do a national search. So here we worked really hard to keep the cost down. And I thought we did an excellent job. So I'm criticized if I spend too much money, and now I'm going to be criticized if I spend less money? I find the question offensive, quite honestly. Okay. Well, we'll move on to another topic. <laughs> okay. I wanted to ask you about Senator Hammerlink. Okay. He recently has got a lot of heat for remarks to students he made this month at the State House. What was your initial response to the comments he made? Well, I, you know, for me, um, I treasure the opportunity to work with students and to listen to them. And I think one of the things that we do at this university is we try to instill in our students, you know, I teach a leadership class here mm -hmm. to freshmen. And I teach a leadership class intentionally because I want students to be involved. And if their predilection is towards politics or service or community service or being a leader in any aspect, it means getting involved in that might be the political process, it might be you know, any other kind of process. And we encourage that. Mm -hmm. And we're going to continue <coughs> to encourage that because I think it's really important mm -hmm. for um, young people I and mean, your taxpayers. I mean, maybe you're not paying a lot of taxes <laughs> yet. But you are, yeah. you know, the future, uh -huh. and you're the future leaders. You're the future, right. future hammerlinks and mm -hmm. and others out there. And you should be um, getting involved in this process every opportunity you have. And I applaud our students. I think our students are fabulous. I think mm -hmm. they're smart. Um, I work closely with shared governance, which means I listen to our student leaders, I listen to our staff council leaders, and I listen to our faculty leaders. And I do think for a leader, whether it's an elected leader or someone uh, appointed like me, it's important to listen. So. The governor and legislator are getting close to setting a budget, but there's still some threat of a government shutdown. Have you talked to the governor or regents about this possibility? Uh, it, there's been some conversation uh, with the regents, mm -hmm. obviously, and it's been, I presume the regents are speaking with the governor. Mm -hmm. um, I think the governor's been very clear that He's not making plans, uh, contingency plans, um, or whatever his contingency plans are, they're not being shared at least. Mm -hmm. um, we're probably less directly affected by a, a government shutdown, largely because the way we get our state appropriations, we wouldn't get our first um, uh, block of money in state appropriations until August 1st anyway. Okay. So we have a window of time. Mm -hmm. We don't anticipate any interruption of services to patients or students. Okay. I don't think you'll <coughs> notice a thing. Okay. Um, it's it's kind of hard to predict because mm -hmm. none of us have been through this before. But right. Obviously, we've got uh, you know we're thinking about it. We'll address the issues as they come up. So. Yeah. You don't think the Im impact that it would have on the university would be <coughs> very large or noticeable? No, I don't. No. No. Again, okay. I don't think I don't think our our uh, constituents are going to notice it. Okay. Whether <coughs> anyone internally okay. notices, I think our budget people are nervous because they mm -hmm. have to try and and uh, meet payroll and mm -hmm. make sure that all of the the normal kinds of paperwork gets done on time. And that takes time when you've got right. a payroll as large as ours. Right. But you know they're they've been good at doing it, and I think they'll work overtime if they have to to get it done, and we'll, we'll see how it works. 